welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully, you're all having a fantastic weekend so far. Happy Sunday to your faces. If you're watching this in the future, happy whatever day it is for you right now. Morning, afternoon, evening. So every Sunday, I have a series where it's a viewer-voted KO Perico heist, right? And that is where you guys vote on how I have to do everything. But today, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be a little bit different. And uh, let me show you why. So let's get to the results here. All right, so here we are on the polls and as you can see the first one i did was for the vehicle as always and as always we don't do the one that was in the previous week which was the vellum and you guys for the majority voted for the annihilator now the next poll as you guys can see right here this is a new one someone asked me last week and i tried looking for the comment but i couldn't find it so i apologize uh, but they thought that this could be cool and i thought you know what it could be cool we'll try it so there was two things here either vote whether you want me to do it as always so you guys all vote for everything i have to do or choose one viewer to do, choose how i do the entire thing and as you can see 70 percent of you voted for that so what i did an hour ago from recording this this is i'm recording this on friday um i said okay so for the viewer voted heist you guys chose for a random viewer to tell me how to do the entire heist so first person to tell me how to do it in the comments will be how i do it notification legends good luck so obviously, if you have notifications turned on, you would have got this on your phone and you could have just jumped in and commented whatever you wanted and you would have won. So you can see we have 13 comments here. Let's take a look. So when you go into it, it looks like there's four, but you can see there's 11 right here on this one. Uh, but let's see, starting from the bottom, Gary says, guys, make it easy. So people for it when he does this, I don't know what you're saying, Gary. I'm going to be completely honest with you. <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. Uh, Joseph says, good luck with this one, lol. Yeah, thanks. All right, and then we have two here. Let's go to this one first, since this one has a ton of comments. F1 Roy says, main dock entry, Alcanist, secondary loot paintings, and cola, bottom map escape. Main gate entry, no outfit, and yes, destruction, success. And then we have Travis. This says, stealth helicopter is entrance, get secondary loot in the main docks. Yes, you can get an outfit. Compound entrance is the grappling hook, which I haven't done in a while. And exit is also the main dock. Okay, so there's no bottom map or anything like that. So in order for me to see who was first here, if I click on sort by newest first, the one at the bottom, which is Travis, is the one that we're going to be doing. No, hence all of these replies. Let's take a look at them. Could have made it harder. <laughs> Uh, and then Tim says, South drop, North drop. What should be the secondary loot and before or after? Yeah, Tim's Tim's on it. Tim's like, we got to make this guy suffer. Come on, give us more information. <laughs> And then Travis says, I didn't want to have a hard one. He can pick, so he's being nice. He's giving me a nice, easy one this week. Okay, this is going to be a short video. You were too nice. Maybe next time we'll make it harder. Tim, Tim really wants me to suffer. Yeah, it does seem easy, but he deserves an easy one for all the things he does for us. Thank you, Travis. I appreciate it. The one person that's being nice to me. Bro doesn't want the world to burn. He doesn't. That's far too nice. I want him to suffer. You're making it far too easy. I'm fuming. You've given it him nice. <laughs> And Travis says, I feel like everyone is mad. Everyone's mad, bro. It's don't worry about it. I appreciate you. Okay. I appreciate you. So obviously there's different ways we can do this. I think what we're going to do for next week. Well, let me know in the comment section of this video, how you like this concept or how you think it could be better, how you think we can improve on it. But what I will say for next week, I'm going to have one of the members choose because I want to give the members a little bit of love here. And um, the way I'm going to do it is let's say we have 20 members. I'm going to have the computer choose a random number between 1 and 20. And whichever one it lands on, for example, if it comes up to the number 8, then I'll go to my members tab and see who's number 8 on that list. And then I'm going to reach out to that person and ask them to do the, well, tell me how to do the heist. So that's what we're going to do next week. But for this week, let me know, like I say in the comments of this video, how you think it could be better or worse or blah, 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 blah. You guys know what I'm talking about. But speaking of members and members, love it's sunday which is the viewer voted day which is where the community comes together to torture me typically but we all come together here so i wanted to give a shout out to the channel members starting off with our taco lovers kai Perina, neon 2k and nate dog 2483 vin makes things austin enox top hawk shelly tim svoboda hug my panda broken warlock cool beans jack langton sassy cassie monkey smasher boba javier key hamilton john mill house jerry M M M palace i always get that all wrong i'm sorry jerry 40 mantis a rob is gaming capucine chapman taunted wolf gary johnson cassie d and chaos simian what chaos simian 
I think that's it. I'm sorry. Next up, we have our Taco Legends. Jace Daly, Dean Fain, Lex Luthor, Up Down All Around, Steve Pip, Daydodic, Cheeky Monkey Sir, and uh, Fizzy, and Insomniac. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate the love. And last but definitely not least, our golden tacos. Amy Post and Ty McNabb. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you guys so much for the extra support on the channel. It genuinely does mean the world to me. Um, I wish I could just give you guys all a big hug. I really, really, really do appreciate it. And I can't wait for next weekend to see who and how you guys make me suffer. But thank you so much. All right, let's carry on. So thanks again, Travis Woodworth. Um, like I say, I appreciate it. It's a nice one. And I, everyone's mad at the poor guy for being, you know, being nice to me for once. Let's, let's appreciate it for what it is, right? We don't always have to be mean to me, man. But yeah, what we'll do next week, I'm going to have it for the members. So I'm going to put all the members' names for next week's one. All the members' names into a wheel. Actually, no, that would be too difficult. What I'll do instead is that I'll see how many members we have. Let's say, for example, if we have 20 members, right? I'll do a number picker and whatever that number it lands on, let's say it lands on six. I'll go to my members, see which one is number six on the list, and I will ask that person to tell me how to do the entire heist. So that's what we're going to do next weekend. But anyway, let me go ahead and set this thing up and get ready. And also, you should I should mention, if you're wondering what the bloody hell's going on with the thumbnail, bro... <laughs> It's AI generated. Just FYI. I've been playing around. Photoshop has some amazing new features. And uh, I was just having a little bit of fun, okay? It, this, it, <laughs> it was just for fun. So anyway, let me go ahead and set this thing up and I'll be right back. And all right, guys, we're back. A little battered and bruised. <laughs> Looks like I've took a little bit of damage there. Um, but we're back. We've set everything up just as asked to do. Um, so we're going to do this. So as requested, we have the Annihilator and for guns, it didn't say, so I just got the Aggressor. Now, a lot of people are going to say, just like they were in the comments on that video or on that comment, um, that he asked me to do it this way. People are going to say it's too easy, yada, yada, yada. Listen, I'm okay with it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, obviously I'm okay with it. But no, it's nice every once in a while, you know what I mean? So we're going to go to the North Drop. Um, and then we're going to do compound entries, drainage, but he wants us to do a grappling hook. So we will be doing a grappling hook. Uh, escape point is going to be the main dock. Time of day is going to be daytime. And that is it. This is the setup. Let's go ahead, jump into this. I'm hoping to get the elite challenge. I'm hoping to get the elite challenge. I'm going to be honest with you. I know there's a disguise at the airstrip, so we'll probably go there and grab that first. As far as the grappling hook's concerned... Uh, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. But for, if we're going to the airstrip for uh, for the disguise, then I guess we can just... We'll, we'll figure it out. Anyway, let's jump into it. All right, here we go. The Stealth Annihilator. Absolutely beautiful aircraft. Are you guys excited for the new DLC that's coming this... Well, next Tuesday? Um, obviously, there's a new jet, which looks cool. I'm not going to lie. But obviously, with all of the new updates that's been happening as far as money... You're probably going to guess that that jet's going to be like 8 to 10 million or something ridiculous. Uh, I can only assume, I can only assume it's going to be a very expensive jet. All right, let's speed this part up here a little bit until we get to our landing zone. All right, here we are. So there should be a motorcycle right underneath us. There is, I can see that. There's another one over there too. So let's just go ahead and jump out. Now, like I say, I know there's an outfit at the airstrip. So I'm just going to go straight for the one that I know it's there. I could probably be faster to go to the main dock or the north dock right over here. Um, but we're not. We're just going to go to the airstrip. So we're going to grab this motorcycle and then head over to the airstrip. But yeah, I'm excited for this new update. If you didn't know, it's called San Andreas Mercenaries. And um, I'm hoping, it didn't say anything about heists, and I don't know if they're going to do any heists or anything like that, because let's be honest, GTA 6 is right around the corner. Um, but I think they should go out, you know, at a bang. They should go out with like, hold on a sec, let me just, uh, how are we going to get this? You know what, let's go, oh, that car just literally turned around. There's going to be someone driving down here soon too, so let's leave our motorcycle right here. Let's remember where it is, right next to these trees. Well, see ya. Where the hell is this guy? All right, he's gone. Should probably take out this camera. All right, and then the outfit's up here, but I should be able to get it. See, you can get it from down here. 
I was going to do this on a video recently. What are you doing? Okay, there we go. Even though it's above me, you can get it from down here. Okay, perfect. Now we've got our disguise. All we need is put our gun away. All we need to do is go and get... Uh, wasn't the motorcycle right here? Okay, it's right there. All we need to do now is go and get a bloody grappling hook. But yeah, I think Rockstar should go out with like a good update. Instead of just being like, we're not going to do any more good updates because there's a new game coming out. No, you should do it with a good update. All right, is the grappling hook here? No, there's not. I'm hoping that there's one next to this car over here. If not, it's okay. There could be one. There's two places at the main dock, but I'm hoping there's one right here. Oh, there is. Okay, perfect. Perfect! <laughs> this is going to be so nice, man. Listen, I, even though I'm saying this is going to be nice, we all know everything always bloody goes wrong for me. So I'm hoping that nothing goes wrong. All we need... They do have me leaving out of the uh, out of the main dock as well. So we're not going to be leaving on the bottom map like... Oop. Excuse me, sir. Don't mind me coming through. Uh, so we're not going to be leaving on the bottom map. So I still need to be as fast as possible. I still need to be as fast as possible. Excuse me, guys. It's coming through. All right. So we need to get... Oh, this isn't now. I mean, technically, you could say this is the main dock, right? But to me, this is mid-map. I call that mid-map main, like the main uh, area on mid-map. And then you have the farm on the mid-map. But anywho. All right. So uh, let's not crash into these people. Okay. So we have a problem. Because for me to get this loot, I'm going to have to take out these two people. And then hope no car comes. Hmm. So the reason I did that, if anyone's wondering, even though we have a disguise, if I, as soon as I start doing what I'm doing right now, they'll hear it and they'll just come after me. What do we got? Is this Coca-Cola? Sure bloody is. All right, I'm just going to keep my eye on the minimap facing this direction. Just in case a car comes. But we're going to be walking up that way anyway, so I'm not too bothered. Because if a car comes, that's going to blow our cover. So even though you guys think this is going to be nice and easy, there is a possibility now. Because of these two guys chilling, looks like they're having a little nap right there, that we could trigger an alarm. All right, so I didn't grab the grass from there. Because I want to check in here. And there is more Coca-Cola. There you bloody go. See, always check. <laughs> always check your places, man. Always check your places. Okay, it doesn't look like there's going to be a car coming. We have everything. We have our loot. We have our grappling hook. We have our disguise. So all I need to do is drive as fast as possible to the compound. And trigger that as our entry point. And then I don't need to panic anymore about this blooming. Those two dead bodies. I don't think anyone else is going to come near them as long as the Jeep doesn't drive down here. But we're going to drive up this road anyway, so we should be able to notice this. Listen, I appreciate it. Thank you for giving me this one. It is nice. It is nice to have a nice, easy one every now and then. It's not always easy, as you guys know. I think typically you try and make it as difficult as humanly possible on purpose, which I'm fine with. It's a lot of fun. It's a nice challenge. Uh, but every now and then, it is definitely nice to get something that's a little bit more easy. You know what I mean? Just so I can relax. You know, it's Sunday. It's nice to relax every now and then. All right, let's go over this wall. Either one of these walls would be fine. I don't think he said I need to go over any specific wall. I'll double check my notes here in a second. Actually, I'll do it right now. You know, I realize as I, if I alt tab out, you guys don't get to see this. So we'll stay here and then I'll alt tab out as soon as we land. Oh, I like this animation. It's one of my favorite animations. All right, as soon as we come out of this animation, I'm just going to alt-tab real quick. Okay, no. So he didn't say I had to go in any specific way. It was Hello, future taco here. While I'm editing this video, as you can see, was stopped on this exact moment because I was very confused as to why we got sore. Um, so I completely forgot because I rarely go in front of cameras when I have a disguise on that you can't go in front of cameras with a disguise. I think this is what happened as well when I did the randoms one last week or earlier this week on Monday. I got sore by, I got seen by the security camera. I completely forgot that the cameras see you when you have a disguise on. I don't know why they see you, to be completely honest with you, but they do. Anyway, let's carry on. There's no specific way. Why the hell did the alarm just go off? Why did the alarm just go off? 
Oh, for God's sakes. I don't have... I have no idea what's happening. Just go. Just jump. Jump. I have no idea what's happening. How on earth did I trick? I told you something would bloody go wrong. I didn't think it would be my own mistake. I'm shooting the sky. I'm shooting the bloody sky. All right, just run. Just run. Ow, this is not going well. This is not going well. I don't want the juggernaut to see me. That is the only thing that's going on right now. Okay, he's gone. I don't know how I triggered that alarm. Okay, so there goes the elite challenge. There goes the bloody elite challenge. I genuinely have no clue what I just did wrong. I don't know how I tricked... We were... Like, none of them... The guards that bloody got me. I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. I'm not going to know until I go back and look at the bloody recording. All right, well, we're not getting the elite... I told you guys, don't think everything's going to go well. Because it's bloody not. <laughs> I genuinely have no idea what I did wrong there. I didn't have a gun out. Let me speed through this real quick. All right, there we go. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I didn't have a gun out. I don't know why the guards... Was it a camera or something that I bloody walked past? Oh, no. Okay, come on. I have no armor, by the way. I didn't get armor. I was like, you know what? This is going to be a fairly easy one. We're not going to trigger the alarm. All I need to do is get in, grab the blooming loot, and then get out, and we'll be bloody good. Nope. Game has different ideas, man. Okay. Well, listen. We do have... I don't even know if it's a good idea. I was going to say, I did get a key from one of those guards, so I can go out that way down there. But I'm trying to think now if I want to go out that way. I could go out that way and then jump up over the wall. Hmm. It's the juggernaut that I'm worried about. We do have a shotgun. But, ah, oh God. And now I need to go to the main dock. Grab a boat. I have no... Uh oh. All right. Eat some snacks. I didn't get snacks either. I literally got nothing. Oh, God. I got to do a key code. Oh, God. There's a guard right there. Don't shoot me, please, guard. Don't shoot me. I beg of you. I saw that guard. I'm... It's been so long since I've come out this way because I don't usually kill people anymore, so I don't get the key. So, yeah, it's going to be a disaster. All right, let's move. Oh. How do you hit me, man? Don't hit me. I'm an innocent person. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. All right, we're going to go out this door. I don't know whether to just run. All right, there's another guy coming. All right, he's gone in that door. I don't know whether to just run. Let's at least take out these two guards. <laughs> oh, God. Hold on. There's another guard. Oh, God. I don't know. I don't... What am I doing? What am I doing? Jump! I'm going to need a different gun. There we go. Oh, God. Eat some snacks. Just run. Just run. All right. We've chose this as our exit. We're good. I don't, I don't know how many snacks I have. I genuinely have no idea how many snacks I have. I don't know if we're going to make it to the boat. I don't know if we're going to make it to the boat to get out of here. I'm so frustrated. I, I can't wait to go back in the edit and see what I did. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys know at this point what I have possibly done wrong. Because I genuinely, as of right now, the only thing I will put a mask on, but what the bloody hell looks that gonna do? Nothing. The only thing I can think of. Hold on, there's a bloody car coming. Okay, sorry, I'm getting quiet. I'm just kind of panicking here a little bit. Okay, this gun's much better for long range than the shotgun. That's why I'm using this. Okay, we'll grab this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to go to inventory. I'm going to go to snacks. We've got a, quite a few PB&Js. Okay, let's just go. So we're going to go off road here a little bit. I didn't do any disruption missions or anything either. But we're going to go off road. All I need to do... All I need to do is grab a boat and get out of here. Right? Simple. Simple. 
Um, okay, there's the helicopter. There's a guard. Let's eat some snacks. Oh my god, look how many people. Oh my god. I'm getting shredded right here. Okay, there goes our snacks. Oh my god, that helicopter. That bloody helicopter. Okay, let's eat some snacks. Let's get off. All right, let's go. Oh no, snacks, please. I think the only, the best thing for me to do is not fall in, but okay. All right, let's go. Inventory, snacks. I think I can do this. Come on. All right, we're going to get shot at like crazy here. Uh-oh. No, no, no. I started drinking bloody beer. I was about to start drinking beer. I think we've done it. I think we've done We haven't got the elite challenge. But I think I have some bloody miracle that we've done it. I mean, he, he choosing the main dock as an escape actually ended up being pretty difficult. We could have just gone off the bottom of the map. Uh, so he didn't make it too easy for me. But he did make it so it was the main dock. So we had to get here. Considering we had no armor, I would say we, done, we did an incredible job right here. I'm kind of sad because I wanted it to be super easy and get the elite challenge. But you know what? I'm sure you guys are happy that there was at least some drama because I know you bloody got everyone in the comments of that. <laughs> that poor guy was saying how it was too difficult or too easy. I don't know how we did that. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know how we triggered the alarm and I don't know how we survived. I think we got lucky that that guy dropped a key so we could come out on the bottom. But even if we didn't come out on the bottom, if we came up top, we could have gone the back way near the panther cage to escape. We could have used a grappling hook to get out too, to be completely honest. Hmm. That was, I don't, I don't know. We got lucky. I almost ran. I didn't get snacks and I didn't get armor going into this. So luckily I had enough snacks on me. That it worked. Let's see how long it took, though. Let's see if we could have... We could have got the Elite Challenge. I don't know. Let's see if we could have got... We know. We all know we could have got the Elite Challenge. I'm pretty sure, even with triggering the alarm right here, we could have got the Elite Challenge. I think even though we had the alarm go off, I think we still did this in, like, 13 minutes. Maybe not, though, because we did go to the airstrip, and that does feel like that was, like, an hour ago. Ah, uh, 13 minutes! <laughs> 13 minutes, 27 seconds. Yeah, we definitely could have got the Elite, so that makes me a little salty, man, but it's fine. Anyway, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section down below um, if you guys have anything you would like to suggest. Do you... Hello? Oh, my God. I just turned my headset down when I was stretching. I <laughs> thought I muted myself. Um, let me know if there's... If you want me to do it differently. Let me know if you want me to go back to the old way where everyone gets to vote. Next week, though, I will have it. So one of the members, I'm going to do a... Also, I'll, well, you'll see. I'm going to choose on, on... I was going to say on stream. I'm going to choose when I'm recording. So you guys will see how I do it. But one of the members next week. And I can only imagine they're going to make it as difficult as possible. Because they're on your guys' side, I promise you. But anyway, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Sorry, you're looking at the back of my head. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. And as always, I'll see you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. Goodbye!